Welcome everybody to the Grim Ripper. Today is Sunday, so we'll be opening uh, some packs uh, that I will be going through uh, basically for my collection tonight. Uh, but it's always fun to watch things get pulled from packs. I thought I'd just finish off the box of 1990 Upper Deck that we were using for our pack wars on Friday. So if you like this video, make sure you hit that like button and get subscribed. Comment on the videos. Get your chance to win prizes on Fridays. So here we go. Six packs of 1990 Upper Deck. Let's see what was left in that box that we were working through on Friday. We pulled quite a few good things from that box while we go were going through the pack wars. I've sleeved all the Hall of Famers up, put a few of them in top loaders, pulled a few Nolan Ryans. I was happy to see that. Let's see what we can pull right now from the last six packs here. I don't know if we had... I think we pulled one Sosa rookie so far from this box. Let's see what else we can find here. There's another sticker. It's a Yankee sticker. Dwayne Ward. And I did put uh, some stickers in a few of the packs going out this week. The folks that had requested those during the live stream, I hope that I got them to everyone who who wanted them. Let me know if for some reason you're you don't get them in the in the mail. Uh, we got there. That's Mickey Tettleton. But there's Roberto Alomar, Hall of Famer. We'll put him on the board. 1990 Upper Deck, Roberto Alomar. Slip on into pack number two. Let's see what we've got here. Okay. Mike Moore to start things off. There's Rafael Palmero. Mark Guthrie. There's Foley and Joe Hesketh. And of course, I like to see a lot of Cubs, but hey, how about a Robin Yount? Hall of Famer Robin Yount. Coming right off, hit the ball, headed out to first base right there, I'm sure. Great shot of him. Rookie Threats, none of whom are Hall of Famers right there. Alejandro Pena. And he's got a sticker stuck to him. That's going to be a Detroit Tigers sticker. Charlie LeBrant. Kelly Downs. Nice. Hey, how about a second year Ken Griffey Jr.? That is always a nice one to pull from the 1990 Upper Deck. It's a great looking card of the kid. We'll get him sleeved up. Maybe. I don't know where I put my sleeves. That's weird. I was just using them. Ah, found them. And set them behind me. Here we go, get him into a sleeve, and then I'll top load him after the video. Good looking Ken Griffey Jr. right there. Great card. Let's see who else we've got. got Vince Coleman, a Bob Hamlin rookie card, and Jack Clark to finish that pack off. On to number three. Pack number three, and not doing too badly, a Robin Yount. Roberto Alomar, and then that Griffey card. That Griffey card is a good one. It's always nice to get second-year cards. Many times, especially in the old vintage cards, the rookie cards get so expensive, but then there's usually a, a pretty good price drop to the second-year cards, so people can sometimes afford those rather than the more expensive rookie cards. Oh, how about a Randy Johnson right there? Another Hall of Famer, Randy Johnson. Put him up there. The other Hall of Famers. Tim Leary and Wayne Edwards. That's a White Sox player. I know Debbie likes to see those. And also Epiphany Card Collector likes the White Sox. Steve Bedrosian and Cal Daniels. There's Mackie Sasser. And Louis 
Meadows. Hey, how about a Bo Jackson card? This is his uh, American League top vote getter. Bo Jackson, not a Hall of Famer, but a perennial favorite. People love to collect Bo Jackson cards. I think we, I think we collect them because of the what might have been aspect, because he was such a great athlete. All right, Matt Noakes on the back of this pack. One of my Cubs players, Lloyd McClendon. There's Moreland and Lind. Looks like we're going to have a Reggie Jackson baseball heroes card on the back of this stack. Looks like he's about to toss his helmet to the line coach. Belcher, and there's Edgar Martinez, Hall of Famer Edgar Martinez, and I believe, is this his rookie card? No, this is not. can't remember when his rookie card is, but there's Edgar. Flowers, and there's another cubby, Greg Smith. Harnish and Alvarez. There's Mark McGuire. Lots of folks enjoy Mark McGuire. I enjoyed watching him play, but once again, I wish he had just continued with his natural ability. Such a great player, was a, a joy to watch. Just sorry he got involved in the in the drugs. And there's Reggie Jackson. Put him right there. Pack number five. Pretty quick rip for the night. We'll be on one more pack after this. I want to thank everybody for dropping in for this short little rip. Most of the uh, Hall of Famers and other cards that come out of these packs that I open on Sunday, if I don't need them for my, my sets, then they end up in my giveaway stack, which we then use as prizes in the Pack Wars and other giveaways. There's Dennis Eckersley, Hall of Famer. Put him next to his Oakland Athletics brother, Mark McGuire. There's Innes and Willie Randolph. Combs. Got a sticker there. It's going to be a pirate sticker. Jose Guzman. Greg Olson again. And there's Billy Ripken, brother of Cal Ripken. Jeff Treadway. Three more cards in this pack. Neil Heaton, a Dean Palmer star rookie card, and finally Rick Mailer. Last card in that pack. Final pack of the night. Here we go with pack number six. It'll make it a nice half dozen run tonight. And we'll start with Hall of Famer Ozzy Smith right off the top. Great card to get, Ozzy Smith. Cubby Jerome Wilson, Dave Smith. Plea sack and a checklist. Ryan Smith and Bill Gullickson. We've got Pettis and a sticker. That's going to be a Cubs sticker. Brian Harvey. Trevor Wilson. And a George Bell. Looks like this might be a fairly uneventful pack. Nelson Liriano. Rob Ritchie. Rookie card, Tino Martinez, and Rafael Belliard. And that will do it for tonight's Sunday edition. Hope everyone had a great time. Hit that like button on your way out. Get subscribed if you haven't. And we'll see everybody on Monday for Monday Madness. It's going to be a short rip tomorrow. We're just going to open one value pack of 2021 Tops Heritage and see if we can find some of the current uh, rookie folks in that one. So we'll see everybody tomorrow. Have a great evening, and we'll catch you later.